bastard. You'll fire his ass one day. I can't find him anywhere, Derek. No miss is a wall. I knew we'd have to drag RC out from that studio. Yeah, I called the still, but there was no answer. Well, there's still time. I'll take the limo. We know this is a difficult time, and we're very sorry for your loss, Mrs. Caldwell. Thank you. Sir, do you mind if we talk to Mrs. Caldwell alone? Well, it's okay. Derek is family. I knew RC for over 20 years. We put each other on the map when I was at Fidelis Records. You folks were at some kind of a party last night? Uh, RC was supposed to receive a career achievement award. He never showed up. You didn't attend the ceremony with your husband, Mrs. Caldwell? RC had to attend a showcase downtown first. It's an industry event for unsigned artists. The man was genius at taking raw talent to the next level. Why did he go to the studio instead of going straight to the award ceremony? He left his tux there. Did he have a problem with anyone who may have been at this showcase? You think someone at the showcase did this? Oh, Pete would never let that happen. Who? Pete Andretti. His bodyguard. RC liked to have protection for certain events. I heard Pete Andretti's in custody. Not anymore. He checked out. So you're nowhere. Uh, we're doing the best we can. That's what they said about Biggie and Tupac. It's been 10 years. People in the industry want results, but they don't want to cooperate. And we know you're not going to be one of those guys, and that's why you identify who's singing on the CD for us. Right, mate? Let's see what we got here. Holla, holla, hollis. Yo, make no difference how you live. With all the ways there is to die. That's four strike. Makes me want to go home and listen to Dean Martin records. Four strike. Never heard of him. He's a kid named Stephen Foreman from Queens. His first album did only 50,000 units. I signed him because I thought he'd really blow up with RC producing. You don't sound too happy about the CD. I'm not. This isn't the single RC and Four Strike just finished yesterday. It's a remix, a different version than what they recorded for the album. Well, what's wrong with doing both? The remix isn't authorized by the label. It's to sell on the street behind the label's back. Four Strike gets 100% of whatever he sells out of his trunk. I gave him 90 grand as an advance. I can't believe Stephen would do this. Look in the gallery, Your Honor. Stephen's friends, his fans, the CEO of his record label, and most importantly, his parents. He is not going anywhere. Bail is set for $2 million, oh, just in case he gets wanderlust. No need to put him on the bus back to Rikers, Your Honor. We have certified checks for that amount right now. I was just on my way to drop a subpoena to Derek Winston for the person's real name. Keep me posted. Yep. The website's a way for detentions artists to connect with our fan base. Record release dates, concert news, and anything else that's happening in the hip-hop world. One of your site's users apparently has some information on Ronald Caldwell's murder. It implicates Four Strike? Actually, it might help him. He'll provide us with the email address of a user named New G? Sure. <laughs> 